So, no! So, what were you saying? <laughs> this is what? This is the prettiest pee place I've ever been. <laughs> why, why would you say that? Because I didn't know it was going to be on camera. And this is what she's viewing out the windshield. <laughs> it's pee per view. <laughs> pee, pee per view. <laughs> the same roads every day We both get there our own way Thistle and an apple tree How different two souls can be But we both grow from the same sorrow If we both know we'll be together can be like a tree in the wind Same old roots but I can bend Turning to understand and sway together Now it's almost like a dance Rendering It just cuts us deeper through The longer I'm away from you Yeah, we fight good We make love better If we both know We'll be together forever I can be like the tree in the wind Same old roots, but I can bend Learning to understand but we're not in the van we're outside of the van we're in a little spot just east of Algonquin Park Algonquin Provincial Park which is the most beautiful place in Ontario maybe even Canada to see the fall colors very popular and it's just starting to turn now around here you see some of the trees that are turning and this is our morning what we woke up to at our beautiful rustic campsite Rob's gonna show you where the van is where we're situated Look at that. Incredible. Views every direction, front and back. Well, not every direction, because I guess to the side we're kind of in the trees, but. So, where, what are we off, what are we off to doing now, Rob? I don't know, we're headed down the railway tracks here, or the old right of way. Oh, turn it on you. Turn it on me, turn it on me, yeah. <clears throat> I don't know, we heard about uh, some places uh, down here, but uh, it's a little precarious because uh, the van is pretty big, and uh, uh, this is a, just the right of way, so it's only really room for one vehicle. And if we meet anybody, and there are people going up and down this road, <laughs> it could be a Mexican standoff, so. Yeah, this is an old uh, rail line. Yeah. And I guess this bridge a few years back was uh, considered condemned and then they rebuilt it and made it a little safer. You can see the original kind of structure down below there, I think. Yeah. But it's, it's I guess, higher water level than usual, but absolutely ridiculously beautiful. Like, we could never buy a campsite this pretty. And the water, you can probably hear, just rushing by as it's so peaceful. Really high water level, I guess, uh, from what it normally is. And we have that view on the other side of the uh, bridge too, where the front of our vehicle comes.
Pretty nice spot, hey Rob? Yep, beautiful. Yeah, these old trestle bridges, uh, the railroads never got rid of them. Uh, and then uh, communities would uh, take them over or different uh, groups. Ooh, I almost fell. <laughs> That's so good, a little precarious. Yeah. There, let me see if I got you in the, no, I'm trying to get you in the shot you so you could talk. Shot, huh? Well, yeah. with, the, with the beauty behind you. Yeah, yeah, I know. Well, oh, and there's a beauty behind, no, never mind. <laughs> the beauty you are, right? Yeah, <sighs> yeah, so. Perfect hat to wear for today's occasion. Yeah, this is different for me. Being underneath one of these bridges or beside it or whatever, because over the years I've been over thousands of them, thousands and thousands of them. 37 years of driving trains and uh, now I'm parked beside an abandoned railroad track. It just seems to be a little uh, ironic, so, but beautiful. So this is the Good. second spot we found. We'll also show you some footage of the other spot we found the night before. Um, both on iOverlander, which we, we hadn't really been using yet because we hadn't really yeah. had a need to. And uh, we found some really nice spots here. Like I say, just, just east, just on the outside of the east gate of uh, Algonquin National Park. Yeah. So not only does it save money, but man, it's so much more beautiful than any campsite you could you ever should purchase. You walk up and go onto the bridge and show it from both sides. Should I? Should I do that? Yeah. yeah Precariously that. holding my coffee and holding, holding the camera. Yeah. See if I can do both. Let's see what we can see here. Oh, if I fall, will you catch me? Well, <laughs> I don't know. So this is the view oh, out the front of the van here, this way. Pretty nice. And there's that bridge you came across. It's pretty precarious. Um, that bridge is pretty precarious. To go across it, it has quite a dip you'll see some footage again of us going over that bridge Woohoo! pretty crazy and the water here because it's a little higher and because it's coming through it with such force uh there's a, quite a current you can see it whirlpools here there's quite a bit of whirlpool effect coming through here pretty rough be nice to canoe i guess as long as you were feeling safe enough but uh it's got quite a current I can take you for a little walk across the bridge if you like. There's the van, there's Ramona, where she stayed last night. Her van, Ramona. And here's the bridge. A few precarious spots in the bridge. There's a little hole down in there. <laughs> and a little hole down over on this edge of it if you were not careful coming across and not along the sides of it you don't want to drop your keys or anything because it's open along the sides so but man what a beautiful place so so pretty incredible absolutely incredible That's our spot down here. We're just, we're talking. Who would like to stay somewhere like this? Let me know in the comments. Because we absolutely love it here. So here's the start of where we came up to get up into this area. And it's a little treacherous. I don't know if you can see here. See, it has quite a bit of a, a dip right here with some rocks. We're a little bit concerned. And pretty bouncy coming up because there's some pretty deep divots too here. See? You can see where the van went over these edges here. A little bit precarious. But well worth it. There's a the van up in there.
Beautiful. So, I'm going to set my coffee down. Or maybe not. Maybe I'll just keep walking. Ooh, that water level is pretty high. So stay tuned for more beautiful places like this. We're going to find as many gorgeous boondocking spots as we can and just try to... Oh, there's Rob now. Here he is. I was just going to cut out here. Oops, oops, oops. <laughs> I was just going to say goodbye to all the people. Did you have to use a little boy's room? <laughs> you have to use a little boy's room? Big boys. <laughs> yeah, people that say, hey, people that say they don't need a bathroom in their van, they must lie. I tell you what. Must they do. You need a bathroom <laughs> in your van. <laughs> oh, yeah, I love it here. I could stay here for a long time, but we have some other places to go and things to see and do. All right, Rob. Oh, don't go in there, look please. At the, look at this. Yeah, Show don't. This. I know. Don't. Don't. Look, look at it. Yeah, I know. Look how don't. rotten it is. I know. There's some spots here that are pretty precarious. I don't know why they didn't get uh, CN ties uh, or uh, uh, creosote ties to redo this. Yeah, I don't know. All I know is it's a little precarious, but we did make it. Hopefully we make it back. <laughs> oh, there's a little chipmunk. Look, it's coming our way. It's coming right to us. Do I have him in the shot? <gasps> there he is. Hey. Oh my goodness. What are you doing, buddy? Whoa, <laughs> he's gone. <laughs> I don't know where he went. He went right down inside there. Even walking on this, some of these are pretty soft. <laughs> I can feel them moving. Well, if you don't hear from us, you know we went through the bridge. <laughs> we sat there last night for a little bit. We didn't have a campfire, but you could. There's a little spot there people were having a fire. But anyways, that's probably enough for now, eh, hun? Yep. Went time, for, time we have hit the road. Can can you hear her humming? Can you hear her humming? Oh, are you filming? Yeah. Why? Oh. <laughs> All right, so here we are. We are walking in or on the old uh we, we feel it might be uh, the Beechberg subdivision. Well, I can tell you what it is. What is it? It's the something Madawaska Provincial Park Road. Well, yeah, they, they've named it a road because it was an old uh, railway right away. Anyway, uh, yeah, it's gorgeous. Let's, uh, let's, let's have a little look. This is it back here. It's so pretty. The trees are just starting to turn. Yeah. Not quite, just a little early still, but getting there. Yeah, it's gorgeous. This is what it looks like. You can see the colors up ahead. Private property, both sides of the trail. Next two kilometers. Next two kilometers. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't think this lake is private property. Well... <laughs> But the property that's a couple of feet behind the lake maybe is. <laughs> Access is probably. As you can see, fall colors are starting. Oh my gosh, look at those reflections in the water, Rob. Yeah, I'm going to try and get them. Look at that. <gasps> so pretty. Oh my goodness. Should I give you a little push? Yeah. <laughs> Very pretty. filming again? No. 
Look at that judgmental look. <laughs> That's what I do. <laughs> yeah, so well. This road is freaking crazy, man. Look at this. Shit. God, this is wild. The river's beautiful, though. It's uh, starting to uh, flatten out here, but where we turned around, it was really nice. It was uh, starting to speed up, and apparently, there's some waterfalls down there and rapids, and everything's supposed to be gorgeous. We'll never know. Anyway, oh, get back in this van, shake the crap out of us, and uh, keep going. Anyway, hope you enjoy this. of water in here oh uh, we've used some of it but still yeah okay 480 <laughs> oh my gosh that was insane that was absolutely insane we we didn't even get halfway to the point we wanted to drive to and we knew there was no other roads to get off so we managed to find a small portion of space on one side to turn around and just went for it because it was crazy now we're coming back up to where we left from this morning which is our beautiful campsite on the river and we're gonna go back over that sketchy bridge and down that little spot just so you can see how steep it is going back down over the other side. I can be like the tree in the wind, same old roots but I can bend, learning to understand and sway together. Love better 